Hello again, my name is Gabe Zona. This is the 4th of February, 2019. Just watched a rather interesting video. It's 17 minutes and 28 seconds of duration. You really want to sit back and have a look at it. The title is Kevin Shipp, Who is Barack Obama? When I got it, it had 52,144 views. Should have a whole lot more. Kevin Schiff was a CIA operative who has spoken out about the U.S. deep state. Kevin Schiff is a retired CIA spook and a whistleblower. He has exposed the U.S. deep state and charged the CIA with systematically use of unconstitutional and illegal measures to terrorize employees to prevent them from becoming whistleblowers. None of that should come as a surprise. It hasn't been a surprise to me, and it shouldn't be a surprise to you. If you folks have been watching me for any period of time, you know that I believe that Barack Hussein Obama was chosen for the role that he's in, probably before his birth. I haven't mentioned that in previous videos. King Abdullah of Saudi Arabia. The objective is the return of the Ottoman Empire the return of the Caliphate. What do we know about Muslims? Well, what we know is they're incredibly patient. They'll wait years. They'll wait centuries. They'll wait, in King Abdullah's case, a lifetime. The objective is to bring Islam to the United States. And that's why Barack Hussein Obama was put into the White House. In videos that I've posted previously, I talked about how Barack Hussein Obama infiltrated every single key cabinet position with Muslims from the Muslim Brotherhood. There's not one that hasn't been infiltrated. The CIA was infiltrated by John Brennan. I've done videos about John Brennan. The CIA director went to Mecca on a pilgrimage. Only Muslims go to Mecca. And he follows Wahhabism, which is the most radical form of Islam. You know who else follows Wahhabism? Saudi Arabia. Don't know if you know this, but in Saudi Arabia, you can't become a citizen unless you convert to Islam. And they follow the letter of Sharia law. Now that brings me to Jared Kushner, Trump's chief senior advisor. Here's a Jew that doesn't understand that the crown prince, Mohammed bin Shalom, would cut his head off if he could get away with it. No different than what they did to that reporter, Jamal Khashoggi. They butchered him and they disposed of his body parts in a vat of acid. These people are evil and vile. King Abdullah funded the Trojan horse, which is what I used to refer to Obama as, the Trojan horse. He isn't what you think he is. His name is the same name as the horse of Mohammed Barak. Folks, you can't make this stuff up. And this brings me to President Trump. What has he done to change the course that Obama set this country in motion? And you've heard me say with the stroke of a pen, President Trump can do what needs to be done, which is to eliminate the protection that Obama gave by bearing his past. And we'll learn the truth about the Islamic extremist, fudgepack and Sunni, homosexual, Muslim, communist, bastard, lying Arab, Barack Hussein Obama. What did he say in his farewell speech to America? Now, he didn't say it once. He said it twice. What he said is, I can't believe we got away with it. Again, President Trump can change all that with the stroke of a pen. Willie, I'm inclined to think not. 
Reason being, he really hasn't done a lot that he said he'd do. He said he'd sign a reciprocity agreement so anyone with a concealed carry can carry anywhere. That hasn't happened, has it? He said that Mexico would pay for the wall. That hasn't happened, has it? And he said a whole lot more. And then you got John Bolton. John Bolton's on a bandwagon for regime change in Venezuela. Trump supports regime change in Venezuela. We saw regime change in Libya. How'd that work out? Who controls Libya now? The Muslim Brotherhood. Hmm? Why do they want to go after Venezuela? Well, they don't want the cigars that Cuba has, but they want the oil and the minerals that Venezuela has. You really need to wake up and smell the coffee. Listen to what's said in this video by Kevin Shipp, titled again, Kevin Shipp, who is Barack Obama. You really need to repost this in all your social media accounts. You need to pass it along to your like-minded friends. Ask them to do the same. You might want to send a copy to President Trump. Ask him, what the hell is he waiting for? Hmm? Thanks for listening. The link will be attached.